Hey everyone, welcome to Global Legends Explored. Today we're going to take a look at the life and career of one of Hollywood's most prolific actors, Johnny Depp. From his early days as a teen heartthrob to his reinvention as a versatile character actor, Depp has captivated audiences for over 30 years. Strap in as we explore the history behind this legendary actor. Early life. Johnny Depp was born John Christopher Depp II on June 9, 1963 in Owensboro, Kentucky. His father was a civil engineer and his mother was a waitress. Depp's family moved frequently during his childhood, eventually settling in Miramar, Florida when he was seven years old. Depp had a difficult relationship with his parents, stating that his father was abusive and his mother was non-supportive of his ambitions to become a musician. As a teen, Depp turned to drugs and hanging out with the wrong crowd. At 16, he dropped out of high school to pursue a career in music. The 1980s. In 1983, Depp and his band The Kids moved to Los Angeles in hopes of scoring a record deal. It was around this time that Depp met and married makeup artist Lori Allison. Struggling to make it big with his music, Depp took a job selling pens over the phone. A friend saw potential in Depp and introduced him to Nicolas Cage, who advised Depp to pursue acting. In 1987, Depp landed his breakthrough role on the TV series, 21 Jump Street. Depp became a teen idol overnight, thanks to his role as undercover cop Tommy Hansen. However, he found himself pigeonholed and wanting to take on more serious roles. Rise to stardom in the 1990s. In 1990, Depp starred in Tim Burton's Edward Scissorhands, beginning a long and fruitful collaboration between the actor and director. The film was a critical and commercial success, showcasing Depp's range and cementing his status as a leading Hollywood actor. Later that decade, Depp starred in films like Benny and June, What's Eating Gilbert Grape, Don Juan de Marco, and Donnie Brasco. He began cultivating his reputation as a versatile actor, often drastically transforming himself for roles. In 1998, Depp led a starring role in Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas, playing gonzo journalist Hunter S. Thompson. To prepare, Depp spent months living in Thompson's basement, studying his habits and mannerisms. This would become another trademark of Depp's, intensely researching his characters. Pirates and critical acclaim in the 2000s. The 2000s were a phenomenal decade for Depp. In 2003, he starred as Captain Jack Sparrow in Pirates of the Caribbean, transforming the Disney ride-based movie into an unexpected smash hit and creating an iconic character that he would return to play in numerous sequels. That same year, Depp earned an Academy Award nomination for his portrayal of Scottish author J.M. Barrie in Finding Neverland. It marked the beginning of a series of acclaimed dramatic performances. He earned another Oscar nomination for his unsettling take on Willy Wonka and Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. In 2007, Depp finally won the Best Actor Academy Award for embodying Sweeney Todd in the Tim Burton musical. In recent years, Depp has faced some controversy due to legal problems and accusations of domestic violence, which he vehemently denied. Despite some commercial misfires like The Lone Ranger, he's continued working steadily, returning to the Pirates franchise as well as taking on the Harry Potter spin-off series, Fantastic Beasts. While his off-screen troubles have occasionally made headlines, there's no denying the lasting impact Johnny Depp has had through his filmography. He will undoubtedly remain one of the most popular and revered actors of his generation. And there you have it, the evolution of Johnny Depp from 80s heartthrob to Hollywood A-lister. Which of his roles or performances is your favorite? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe for more videos about your favorite celebrities and movies.